show you here how to find uh, the standard error of estimate uh, using the calculator. Also going to show you how to do this by hand. Uh, we'll do it by hand first. So uh, first thing we're going to do by hand uh, is calculate. Uh, well, actually, the first thing we should back up. The first thing we did was enter the data. So here, this is page 501, example two. I have the data, and look at this. I left a piece of hair there. Let me get some shedding. Okay, uh, this is what COVID does to me. Sheds. Anyways, uh, L1, L2, X, X1, Y1. So now we need to figure out how they come up with this column. Quit out of here. Stat. Calculate. Number four. Uh, go down to calculate here. Okay, now um, A times X, so A times this value plus B. So we can put this equation with X being uh, L1 it, right into our, uh, our edit here. Okay, so A times L1 plus B. So we go to VARS. Since we just did the uh, linear regress, we should have this in our ours. We're going to go to number five. Um, we did it under, oh, here it is, A. We want A, so we just did that thing and showed up as A. We want to take that times L1 plus, if I'm going too fast, just pause, rewind, whatever, do what you need to do. Uh, VARS again, number five. Uh, we want equation. We want number three, B. Hit enter. Boom. There they all show up. Okay, next column. It's Y1 minus Y hat. So this value minus this one. So I would just go L2 minus L3. Boom. There they are. Okay, the next one is just this column squared. So you can actually save a step and you can do all your calculations a little quicker than they do but it doesn't matter here. So I want L4 squared. There we go. Okay, so that comes up with 108 point something. Um, oh wait, no, next thing we'd wanna do is the sum. So how do you get sum of, uh, in your, in, of a, a list in your stats? So you go to edit and go to, there's a couple different ways you can do it. We'll just do the easy way. One of our stats, I want, what was it? Uh, I forgot what list it was. L5. Okay, so one of our stats. L5. And what this is going to do is it's going to calculate the sum for me. Um, and some other stuff. But it's going to calculate the sum. So here's the sum. Sum of X, 108,563. And obviously we've got some other stuff here too. But that's the number I want for the calculation. Uh, and the calculation for the standard area would be the square root of that. Uh, go into VARS, go to number five, sum, I want the sum of the x's, and I want to divide that by n minus two, because we have two sets of data, so I want to take n minus two, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, so I want to divide this by our uh, degrees of freedom, and so you get the standard error uh, by hand. Boom. Okay, by calculator, it's a lot easier. Go to calculate, go to tests, Lindreg t test, uh, L1, L2, hit enter. My standard error is S, 116.49. So, however, you want to calculate that, uh, you got a couple different ways. My guess is you'll probably do the second way, but I don't know, whatever. Hope all is well.